Hi there again, it's the uh, tea grub camper man here. <laughs> hey, because I love my tea and I like my grub and I'm a camper man. So there we go. Anyway, I thought I'd share something with you uh, this time. I don't know if you've had this problem yourself, but I found that in the past, when I've tried the bow and drill um, method of starting a fire, I found that the paracord or the the um, shoelace or anything like that tends to fray very quickly and then snap and all that effort's wasted. And what I have found very useful, I've been using this for a while actually when I use this method, is the strimmer wire. I just put the spectaculars on because I need those now. But yeah, it's a short piece of strimmer wire and this lasts for ages. I can use that time and time again and tend to keep a little bit of that in my kit just in case. Uh, I'm just going to demonstrate to you how, how well it it works and hopefully I can just get this little nest ignited that I've got beside me so I'm just going to go and give it a go and we'll see how we get on <laughs> let's hope it. there we are I've got my um, my bow I've made my hearth there and this is I've used wild plum for this it's well seasoned and I've got it up from the garden here and I've made my drill and uh, I've got my bearing block and a little thin piece of timber there to catch my uh, ember. So I will give it a try. So first of all is I just uh, tie a knot in the end of that and I've just put a couple of saw cuts in the end of the bow so I can put my strimmer wire in. But just give it a firm pull, <laughs> not too firm. <laughs> um, okay. Now I'm just going to measure this. That always happens. <laughs> well, it does with me anyway. Okay. And I'll just put it slightly tighter because this does stretch a little but not too much. And I'll just wrap that round like that. And then I'll just tie. A hitch in that. Give that a good old tug. Now it might be a little bit loose. If it is, we can always adjust it. Yeah, that doesn't feel too bad. So we'll put our little piece of little sliver of timber there.
There we go. <laughs> Took a little bit of effort, but got there. And as you can see, perfectly intact. That's good for so many times. So a little bit of that in your kit can prove useful. It's not the uh, it's not the panacea for life small fires, but it's certainly a useful addition to have in your kit. So thanks for watching, and uh, T Grub Camperman over and out.